If you're a habitual slicer and you want to get to the root of the problem with one easy fix on one easy practice method, you've come to the right place. Let's get you playing your best golf in 2024. Oh, I'm Andrew Cullen and this is Golf Yourself to Live. Let's start with the physics of the exercise. The ball starts where the club face is facing. So if it comes back to strike, it's facing square, the ball at least will start in your desired direction. If it's open at strike, the ball's gonna start right. So we have to get control of the club face first to get the ball starting in the right direction. And the biggest influence on the club face for the right hand golfer is the left hand position. If we get the left hand position weak, then the left forearm will rotate in the wrong way through strike and that'll open up the club face. So we need to get the left hand in its natural position that the left forearm will come back to its natural position and keep the club face square. So how do we do that? Super simple fix. We let the left arm hang, we place the club into your left hand, and then you'll see, like it says in all the textbooks, that we grip it in the fingers and not in the palm, that the very important, the ball of the hand sits on top of the club, and then we just place the thumb just to the right of center, so it's in its natural position. The left arm wants to come back to where it started, that'll bring the club face back to where it started. Now, if you've been fighting with that open club face, the ball starting to the right of target, then the body and the brain will do everything possible to try and hit it left. So all the compensations start to come in, swinging over the top, not getting the weight shift right because we need to close the club face, trying to get chicken wings and wrists moving this way, all trying to shut down the club face. We don't need to do that now because the left hand's in a great position. So how do we practice a simple way without getting too technical to swing the club from the other direction, from inside? A super simple solution, peeps. You just grab a handful of balls or something similar, put them outside of your ball in a nice little curving line, and we're trying to get the club head and your brain and your body to follow the line. So again, the disaster swing that we've been doing with the left hand in a weak position was to swing over the top, balls everywhere. And what we're trying to do is get the club coming from inside. So don't worry about too much how you're doing it. Just tell the brain and the body, this is what we want. This is what we're gonna do. All right, let's get it from inside. Beautiful. If you need a deeper understanding of swing concepts, check this video out and I wish you a slice-free 2024.